Okay, guys, <laughs> I am on my last page. I still have some elements that I still can add on, and I'm first going to do that. So with this one, I made a fold line one fourth, so I have an extra um, hold, an extra gusset. So I'm going to apply this a little away from the edge, nice and straight. I think this is a nice spot, I guess. Yep, will not interfere anything. And it's still nice and thick, so I still can add loads of things in here. All right, so. Take this a little tight, so. And then still I have a big page, a big page where I can add stuff in um i think i'm just gonna add a few extra pages on here a few big pages so i can create some um big photo mats as my final um, i think this album i really like how it turns out with all the little elements but i think we can make some extra pages in here just to create some extra spots for photos I think that will be nice. So yeah, it's actually nothing new. I'm just going to make some pages. I'm just going to make some, some flippity flops. And then we just can add this on the page. So I'm just going to score one piece. Score another piece. And burn this down, and then I just can just stay a little away from this fold line, and then I'm just gonna make a mark. That one I am gonna cut down, and from the other part, the other one is going to be right here, and that's. Also, I'm going to take it up here so I can see better where I need to make. Just stay away a little. Alright, so I need to cut this down and then we can add this. Actually pretty simple. And then add a few more pages. So, put this in here and this on my left side. And then we have some extras. Simple as that. Okay, and yeah, of course you can do whatever you want. You even can cut these in half and add these on for having a little more playful or just one. That's also a possibility. Let's, let's just do that. Let's just do that. Don't think too hard. Just fold these in two. Don't think too difficult, guys. All right, just... Burn this down, just cut this in two. And then you already have that one millimeter space in between. Maybe we can make a nice... Oh, let's, let's go crazy. Let's, let's just use this one for change. Yeah, and before you're gonna add it, we can decorate. So this is gonna be right here, and then this on the top. Cool, I like it. Yep, or on this side, that's totally up to you. But I think uh, I want it on the other side. But anyways, um, I'm gonna decorate these two, and I still have this pocket. So I want to have this, well I also can do it on the inside, oh maybe that's a better idea. Alright, so I'm going to let this in one piece, let's just use the same corner to make it nice and uh, let's just decorate my all the leftover pieces that I have and then I can just put it in. Alright guys, just have fun, use your leftover pieces and it's not that difficult. Nope, it's not. Just 
playtime. Yeah, fun part. Cutting papers, using glue. Oh, using your smooching tool and always use black. Not always. I'm not telling you lies. I don't use always black. This time I like to use black. Alright, so oh, what else do I have? I still have a few. Of course, I have my little pile right here. I have some stickers left and I still have this left and then the rest that I still have oh I don't think I yeah I also have quite a few of these left but that's it the rest I just put in my What shall we do? Well, we're just gonna see what we're gonna do. We do have plenty pieces left to use. So let's decorate. Do you wanna have some photo mats? Then just use the things that we just did earlier. But I think I'm gonna make some photo mats and same as we did earlier. All right. <laughs> okay, so I'm done with the decorating. So let's see how this will look. All right, here are my two pages. Now I am wondering which one. These are just fitting. And then this one on this side. Yeah, something like that. All right, so I'm gonna start with one piece here below, completely at the bottom. Just make sure that these three, these two are not bumping into each other, and they don't because we cut this in half. So that's the beauty of making first a one page and then cut it in two. Then you will be safe, at least as safe as you can be. I'm gonna try to be as close as I can to this, so this can still can be fold back. All right, and then either way, this here and this here. Yep, I think I like it. I don't think it will fit the other way, but oh yeah, it does. It does fit. All right, so yeah, you can decide which which way you want, but now I still have a page inside, and I am going to use my last pocket, my last small pocket, and then the rest I'm gonna, I think. Do we have something left? I still have <laughs> this left. Look at my pile. It's getting smaller and smaller. All these little 
little bits right here, which I love using and it's a little basket with small pieces. Oh, I still have my chipboard pieces and all these cut aparts. Alright, and then this is what I have left for the 12 by 12 papers, but that will not be enough to cover this. And so we do need something else. Let me check which. Oh, this one we actually do not. Did not use that much. Oh, it's this one. Right. What else do we have? This one we have. This one I like too. The stripes. Yeah. What can we use, guys? What shall we use? Well, I like this one because it also is here too. So we do need to change this. <laughs> or I'm just gonna use no I'm just gonna use one I'm just gonna use one so I don't have any big papers alright so yeah that is what we are going to do cut this down Try not to sing, sorry guys. <laughs> oh my goodness. And I decided, by the way, to not use a... Um, a album closure. Just because I think this album does not need closure and maybe I will go for the closures another time on another album but for this one I will keep it just like this what do you think about this and then Oh, pocket. Well, I do like it. I do like it. All right. So how I'm gonna add this? Well, I do like this at the back, right here. So I'm just gonna add some glue. Here we go. And then I'm just going to peel this off and put it on. It's that simple. Yeah, yeah, yeah. one you still can use a nice border maybe to connect these two but if you like it already and that's fine there we go but I was maybe thinking about Something like this or so, but or another. But and, yeah, mm -mm. 
I think it's beautiful already. What do you think? Alright, so and yeah, here we have our pocket, which well is actually a nice tuck spot where you can add still your photos in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Or big ones. Anything you can tuck in here. Yeah, cool. I like it. I like it. And then everything is closed. Yeah, I really think I like this. Cool. Oh, wait, just a sec. I do have so a few things left. But maybe I can just use these to store in here. I lost my last two pieces. Yeah, cool. You can add images if you want. But I think it's busy enough. And yeah, guys, I am finished. Um, so yeah, not much left. Just as as how I like it. Um, so yeah, that is exactly what I did. <laughs> I'm so happy. I had so much papers for um, for this this collection, and I had full packs and uh, used packs. And yeah, sometimes me and my mom we do email go on um, several markets or fair craft fairs or anything, and then. Yeah, sometimes we do buy secondhand papers and sometimes we do buy used papers. And I always like to put one collection in one uh, box. And now, as I see, <laughs> so I just <laughs> look at this. I still have, <laughs> I still have, and I, I, I think it's almost a full pack. This is definitely one full one. This is also definitely one full one. It's not used whatsoever. So I do have a 12 by 12 and an 8 by 8 full. And I believe this is almost a full one. I believe I did grab one piece, but yeah. So I still have plenty, but I first used all the little bits. And that is where I made this album from. All the little bits and all the loose papers and as you can see you also we also made uh, the chipboard the cover with chipboard from pizza boxes so oh, i'm so happy to do this so is this a low budget project mm, maybe yeah because i did used used papers and i did use pizza boxes chipboard and yeah you can still make something with used things and that does not mean that it's not gorgeous. I really like how this album turns out. So I hope you like this short. Um, yeah, I still have that other paper from Prima Marketing. Um, maybe it's gonna take me the next few months <laughs> when I'm gonna start on that one. But this one really creeps in my mind that I needed to finish this before I do anything. So I promised myself to first finish this one because I love working with Graphic 45. I do. I especially love this 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 special collection. I love it. I love the colors. It's very nice. It's solid. It's not solid, but it's the, the colors are just. I love it. Yeah, I can tell you that a million times. Okay, anyways, thank you so much for watching and hope to see you next time. Bye-bye.